Hi guys, it's me Robert with a new video. Today I'll be showing you guys a crazy $750 computer build. It currently costs $763. It will easily play all the modern games on max settings at at least 60 FPS. Let's start our build with the processor. Here we have the Core i5 3350P IV Bridge processor. This is an incredibly powerful CPU. It should be go both good for video editing and gaming. The P in the name means that there is no integrated graphics. That's not a big deal, since in our case we'll be using a dedicated graphics card. Now let's take a look at the graphics card. Here we have the enormous Gigabyte Radeon 7950. It has a triple fan design, which means it will be very overclockable and silent. In fact, it's already factory overclocked. It can play Battlefield on ultra settings with anti-aliasing set to max at 60 FPS minimum. So it's an amazing card. Next up, we got the motherboard. In this build, we'll be using the Gigabyte GA-B75M-D3H motherboard. It supports SATA free, PCIe free, and USB free all of which we can use, since in this build there is a SATA free drive, PCIe free card, and the case has USB free. In fact, I have this exact same motherboard in my own computer build. It's a very good quality motherboard and I'm very satisfied with it. You guys can check out the unboxing of it on my channel. Let's continue with the, with the build. Next up we have the RAM. Here we have 8 GB of Corsair RAM clocked at 1600 MHz. Corsair makes good quality and performance RAM, so it should work perfectly. Continuing on, we have the storage device. It's the Western Digital Blue 500 GB hard drive. It spins at 7500 RPM and supports SATA free. It's a pretty fast drive, and of course, it's Western Digital so it should be very reliable. Let's take a look at the heart of this build. The power supply is the Corsair CX600. It provides 600 watts of power and with 80 plus bronze efficiency. It's important to have a reliable power supply since a bad one can easily damage the other components of the computer. This Corsair power supply is very good quality and should work perfectly. Last but not least is the case. In this build we'll be using the Rosewell ATX mid tower case. It supports free accounts with free fans which will keep the system very cool. It also supports USB free which is a good thing to have. So that's it for the $750 gaming computer build. It should be fantastic for gaming and will work for many years to come. Thank you for watching and see you guys later.